In the vast mosaic of Earth's wildlife, armadillos emerge as fascinating enigmas, donned in their armor-like shells, their lives intricately woven into the fabric of the Americas. As we delve into the world of these unique mammals, we uncover a tale of adaptation, resilience, and quirky traits that define their existence. Armadillos belong to the family Dasypodidae, a group characterized by their distinct bony plates, or scutes, that provide a protective shield. From the feisty pink fairy armadillo to the sizable giant armadillo, these creatures epitomize the diversity of the natural world, showcasing an array of shapes, sizes, and behaviors. One of the most intriguing aspects of armadillos is their armor. This shell, composed of tough, overlapping scutes, acts as a defense mechanism against predators. Some species, like the three-banded armadillo, take this a step further by curling into a ball, presenting an almost impenetrable fortress. It's a sight to behold, a living testament to the wonders of evolutionary adaptation. Armadillos have a knack for digging, employing their strong claws to burrow into the ground. This behavior isn't just about creating shelters, it's also a key aspect of their foraging strategy. Their diet primarily consists of insects, larvae, and small invertebrates, and the burrowing allows them to access hidden prey. Their keen sense of smell aids in locating food, while their long, sticky tongues are adept at extracting insects from tight spaces. A noteworthy feature of armadillos is their reproductive strategy. Unlike most mammals, armadillos often give birth to identical quadruplets. This phenomenon, known as polyembryony, occurs when a single fertilized egg splits into four embryos, resulting in a set of genetically identical offspring. This unique reproductive trait contributes to the rapid population growth of armadillos in their habitats. The armadillo family boasts around 20 different species, each with its distinctive characteristics. The nine-banded armadillo, common in the United States, is known for its proficiency in digging and is a master at crossing bodies of water by inflating its stomach to increase buoyancy. The giant armadillo, on the other hand, is the largest of the species, showcasing the diversity within the Dasypodidae family. These armored marvels have an ancient lineage, dating back to the Paleocene epoch. Belonging to the Xenarthra superorder, which also includes anteaters and sloths, armadillos are part of a unique group of placental mammals that have stood the test of time. This evolutionary history underscores their resilience and their role as enduring members of the mammalian legacy. Armadillos inhabit a variety of environments, from grasslands and forests to deserts and scrublands. Their adaptability is evident in their ability to thrive in different landscapes, navigating the challenges posed by diverse ecosystems. Interestingly, their quest for survival has led some species to venture into urban environments, showcasing their remarkable ability to coexist with human settlements. One notable quirk of armadillos is their tendency to jump when startled. This behavior, known as jumping jacks, is an amusing sight as the creatures use their strong hind legs to propel themselves into the air. While this might seem like an odd response, it is believed to serve as a defense mechanism against predators, creating confusion and providing the armadillo with an opportunity to escape. Armadillos are known for their excellent sense of hearing. Their large, funnel-shaped ears help them detect the faintest sounds, contributing to their ability to detect predators or other potential threats. This heightened sense of hearing adds another layer to their survival toolkit, allowing them to stay vigilant in their environments. Intriguingly, armadillos can carry the bacteria that causes leprosy. While the risk of transmission to humans is considered low, it has led to caution in handling these creatures. The association with leprosy has sparked scientific interest in studying armadillos to gain insights into the transmission of the disease. The smallest of the armadillo family is the pink fairy armadillo, native to Argentina. Its pale pink coloration and delicate appearance are a stark contrast to the robust armor of its larger relatives. This species, with its specialized adaptations for digging, is a testament to the diverse strategies that armadillos employ for survival. Armadillos, surprisingly, have a relatively low body temperature compared to other mammals. This lower body temperature is thought to be an adaptation to their burrowing lifestyle, 
where the underground environment provides a stable and cooler temperature. Some armadillos, like the screaming hairy armadillo, are vocal creatures. They produce a series of high-pitched squeals when threatened or during confrontations with other armadillos. This vocalization is a distinctive feature in their communication repertoire and adds a layer of complexity to their social interactions. Armadillos exhibit a curious behavior known as bathing. This involves rolling in dust or sand, covering their bodies with the particles. While the exact purpose of this behavior is not fully understood, it is believed to play a role in maintaining their hygiene by removing parasites and excess oil from their fur. The lifespan of armadillos varies among species, with some living up to 15 years in the wild. However, their existence is fraught with challenges, including predation, habitat loss, and encounters with vehicles. These factors contribute to the variability in their lifespans across different environments. Armadillos, with their unique features and behaviors, have also found a place in folklore and cultural narratives. In many South American traditions, armadillos are associated with protection and are believed to bring good luck. Their distinctive appearance and behaviors have inspired stories and myths among indigenous communities. Conservation efforts are crucial for the well-being of armadillos, especially as they face threats such as habitat loss and fragmentation. Understanding their ecological role and implementing measures to mitigate human-wildlife conflicts are essential steps toward ensuring the continued survival of these remarkable creatures. If you learned something from this video, please leave a comment below, click the like button, and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.